Rasmussen. I'm a chief consultant with Medcom, a public national competence centre in Denmark. I'm also a member of the board of directors and the treasurer of ETAM. Medcom's been a member of ETAL for many years. We first joined because we wanted access to a network of peers of organizations thinking about digital health, known as health telematics at the time, uh, in the same way that we were. We wanted to learn and we wanted to build a European uh, network of partners to collaborate with. We also needed access to expertise around um, European policies, strategies, programs, etc. Today, our membership at ETEL is still very important to our work because it's a place where we can learn from others and uh, we find out what's happening at a European level, uh, international level. Um, so it frees up, you can say, some of our internal resources by having access to people who are specialized in these areas. There's a diversity in the membership of ETEL that we find to be a real strength. There's both small and large, public and private. There's industry, academia, health providers, competence centers like ourselves. And it's really the, the value in bringing all of these organizations together, this multi-stakeholder platform that continues to be of relevance uh, to us. So we will stay a member for VTEL because we think it's, uh, it's very beneficial. And I think that many other organizations working in a digital health or health innovation uh, is able to get value from an ETEL membership. And if you're interested to learn more about what ETEL does and what it can provide, I would suggest to go to etel.eu, uh, the website, uh, to learn more. And um, hopefully I will see you at some point then as an ETEL member. Thank you for your time. Thank you.